How's it going team? How you guys doing? Coach Gus right here with you guys. I have uh, just a little message I wanted to send out to you guys. Um, I hope you guys are all doing awesome. I hope you guys are going hard in the challenge. It's week two of the challenge now. Tuesday guys. So I know some of us are kind of, you know, we started off super strong. We're probably still going strong at it. Some of us probably are a little bit discouraged, maybe losing that momentum, maybe feel like they're trying to get back into it, but don't know how to, right? I'm gonna let you guys know a little bit of uh, my why, what keeps me motivated, guys. So putting myself first, okay, guys, it's extremely important is my why is, is just knowing the benefits okay i've come i come from a very you know a, a, a past that wasn't always um so uplifting so motivating so i wasn't always positive i wasn't always in a great in a great place in my life mentally emotionally physically all of the above guys um and so growing up you know with parent with my mom my mom was a single parent actually um not having much honestly moving every year um, my child of uh, my upbringing wasn't always like it wasn't always the best to be honest I'm gonna be a hundred and twenty thousand percent honest with you guys all right I struggled a lot I moved a lot and most of the time my mom wasn't in my life um, so I had to do a lot of the growing up on my own and kind of just learning and going and just raising myself almost um, and my little brothers with me okay so that um, brought a lot of things, you know, in my family, we have a lot of like, um, I have uncles that are like drug addicts and my mom was dealing with alcoholism and, and just a bunch of other things that went as I was growing up and growing up and growing up. Finally, I got older, 18. I moved out at 17 actually. And so um, I've just been on my own a lot. And so I learned to build myself. I learned to, to take things, um, to work hard um, for myself. For my own good because I know I didn't want to be anywhere where my uncles were or where my brothers um, my older brothers were you know I wanted to do better than that because I knew that I could and I wanted also to do it for my mom you know because she went through a lot um, raising all her kids she had seven of us so raising all the kids on her own being a single mom and having all of these problems um, anxiety depression and then on top of all these other things thankfully she's not there anymore but that was the case back then seeing that and learning that that was not the person I wanted to be. I also grew up um, and came and developed my own insecurities, my own anxiety, my own depression. And I promised myself uh, after my uh, own little personal troubles and, and mistakes in life that I have made, because I am not perfect, guys. I've made a ton of mistakes. I'm still making mistakes. But, um, you know, after meeting people, being in relationships, um, making mistakes, being sad, heartbroken, depressed, broke in the streets, hungry, starving, all of that, you know, just made me into the person that I am right now today. And I'm so proud of who I am right now. I know that I have so much more to go, but I used to be extremely insecure. I used to put myself last. I used to put everyone first and you needed me. I was there at ready like I would drop what I needed for you I would give up what I had just to make you happy I don't care I wouldn't care what that meant for me where that left me even if that was in the streets okay so growing up with that mindset um, yes it's good and but it also wasn't the best for me it left me in a lot of bad places all the time sometimes um, and also people don't reciprocate that type of uh, uh, care um, or love towards you, you know what I mean? They just some there's a lot of people who who will take as much as they can and then when you need something They probably won't be there, right? So I learned through all of that guys and you know I was extremely insecure back then uh, growing up and I learned that um, I had to take care of me. I had to put myself first. I had to do it for me because um, no one was going to put me first. No one was going to tell me um, You're beautiful. You're awesome. You do great um, No one was gonna tell me these awesome things only I could tell myself that okay. Sorry that I'm getting a little emotional about that um, but but that's just the truth guys like um, Rarely you'll get someone telling you like, you know, you're beautiful 
or hey I hope you have an awesome day um, you know I wish you the best like regularly we don't get that um, on a day to day right um, sometimes even our own family members don't give us that um, and not that they don't love us maybe they just were raised in a different way maybe the way they were brought up wasn't the best and so they're stuck on specific things or they don't know how to express all of that whatever the reason is sometimes we don't get it from our family but um i know i didn't get it and i know that growing up i had to tell myself that and i got to a point where i was tired of being insecure i was tired of being scared i was tired of putting myself last and dropping everything for everyone and getting nothing in return. Um, I was just tired of that and I decided one day, you know what Gus, you're gonna do this for you because no one is gonna do it for you. So one thing I told myself is either the people are gonna love you for you or they're not going to love you for you, okay? So I took it upon myself to put myself first, work really hard, all right? I work every single day to get better. I work every single day to get healthier, all right? I get, one of my thing is, if you look good, you feel good, you've heard me say it. Um, and that's not just on the outside, guys, that's also on the inside, okay? So I don't want you to think it's all like, oh, I, I'm gonna get all done up, um, you know, this and that. No, this all comes from all that that I had to go through, okay? Yeah, I take pride in the way I look. You know why? Because I wasn't always like this. I wasn't always this happy. I wasn't always this chipper. I didn't always look like how I look now. If you see me back then, you probably wouldn't recognize me. Um, but I've come a long way and it takes so much pride in that. And if I look good, guys, I feel good. All right, so I decided to put myself first. I decided to put my needs first. I'm not, make, I'm not pushing anyone else. You know, I'm not being negative towards anybody else. I'm not harming anybody else. But you know what I am gonna do? And what I decided to do is put my health first, stay on top of my fitness, Every now and then I mess up, yes I get it, but I get back on it, I go hard, and I keep pushing forward because there's nothing better than putting yourself first, there's nothing better than taking care of yourself, all right guys? That is my why, that keeps me going, that keeps me pushing forward, is that, putting myself first, knowing that I am sent here in this world to help someone else, all right? That is, that, that is what, I know that if I'm taking care of me, I can take care of you. Okay, if I'm not taking care of me, I can't take care of you. I can't do anything for you. I can't offer you nothing. Okay, but I'm taking care of myself. I'm trying to get better. I'm trying to get healthier. I'm trying to learn more. I'm trying to get wiser. I'm trying to learn all these different things with all of you guys and my team. I have different clients, different, they need different things. And I'm trying to learn it all, all right, for you, because I want you to do good, all right? So when you guys think about your why, and some of you, maybe you think you don't have anyone who cares or you don't this and that. Well, guess what, guys? I care. Right here. I care. I see you guys every day. Maybe sometimes not as often as you think. Um, and maybe you don't even think about it. But I do care about you guys. And I love all of you guys. Like, I want all of you guys to succeed. I want you guys to do awesome in this challenge in life and everything i want nothing but the best for you and i care about you guys i have built relationships with each and every one of you guys to you i might may be i'm just another coach and that's fine but to to me you are not just another client you are you an individual and i care about you as if i would with my sister my brother my mom i treat you that way and that is what i give you my time all right i give you guys care i listen all right, and I want you guys to know that. All right, if you're having a bad time, if you're off track, and if you don't know how to get back, put yourself first. All right, I believe in you, and I love you, and I know you can do this, guys. So get away from all that negative, and maybe you may, maybe you can't get away from the negative, right? But guess what? You have someone that is rooting for you. You have someone that is believing in you, and that is me, and I'm at the studio, guys, and I see you there, and I push you guys, and I encourage you guys, and I love you guys, and I it all comes from a good place all right i want to know what your why is i want to know what keeps you going what is it that 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 that, that keeps you motivated what 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 is your why share it with me guys share it with the team i want all of you guys drop a hashtag the hashtag my hashtag is put your hashtag put yourself first all right hashtag if you look good you feel good all right those those two are my 
hashtags, I take them in dearly, I, I hold them, and that is what I preach, and that is what I do, and that is what I will keep doing forward. I'm here with you guys, I'm here for you guys. Share your hashtag, share your why to everyone else. Maybe your story will inspire someone else, guys. Comment, share um, um, your hashtag, and just share all the love, all right? Show everyone else. Maybe someone else is going through whatever you're going through right now, and maybe some, some words of wisdom, some encouragement will help someone else too. All right, Dream Team. Um, I hope you guys are going hard. I hope you guys are like staying strong. I'm with you guys. If you have any questions, you guys know, reach out. I'm here for you guys. Have a good day, guys.